Morris Chestnut is an American actor and film producer. He first came to prominence for his role as Ricky in the 1991 film Boys in the Hood. He's appeared in feature films and on television series, including the starring role of FBI agent Will Keaton in the NBC TV series The Enemy Within. In 2015, People magazine named Morris Chestnut as one of the sexiest men alive. In March 2022, Chestnut was inducted to the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Morris Chestnut has an estimated net worth of $8 million U.S. dollars. About Morris Chestnut's early life Morris Lamont Chestnut was born on January 1, 1969 in Cerritos, California. He's the son of Shirley Chestnut and Morris Chestnut Sr. His mother was a teacher while his father worked as a medical salesman. He studied finance and drama at California State University, Northridge. He worked as a bank teller prior to being an actor. Morris Chestnut is 6 feet tall or 1.83 meters tall. About Morris Chestnut's personal life Morris Chestnut has been married to Pam Bice Chestnut since 1995. The couple has two children, son Grant Chestnut, who was born in 1997, and daughter Paige Chestnut, who was born in 1998. He was raised in the Baptist Church, and he is a practicing Christian. He was also a sponsored poker player for Full Tilt Poker. In March 2022, Chestnut was inducted to the Hollywood Walk of Fame with a star that was unveiled in his presence. About Morris Chestnut's Professional Career Morris Chestnut's first professional acting role was as Jason in Freddy's Nightmares, A Nightmare on Elm Street, the series, Season 2, Episode 19, A Family Affair, which aired on February 18, 1990. His first feature film role was as Ricky Baker in Boys in the Hood in 1991. He followed that up with roles in various TV movies. He also played a role on Patti LaBelle's short-lived sitcom Out All Night. His career continued to rise steadily with co-starring roles in standard big-budget studio films such as Under Siege 2, Dark Territory in 1995 opposite Steven Seagal and Katherine Heigl, and G.I. Jane in 1997 opposite Demi Moore. He was also a regular cast member on C-16 in the role of Special Agent Mal Robinson from 1997 to 1998. In 1998, he won the annual Madden Bowl video game competition. In 1999, Morris Chestnut starred in The Best Man with Tay Diggs and Nia Long as a professional football player on the eve of his wedding. The Best Man earned positive reviews from the press and did well at the box office. For his performance, Chestnut earned an NAACP Image Award nomination. He again played a football player in The Game Plan in 2007. In 2001, he starred in The Brothers, a film centering on the themes of fidelity and success among young professionals. That same year, he portrayed Keith Fenton, the love interest of Vivica A. Fox in Two Can Play That Game, and appeared as basketball player Tracy Reynolds in the 2002 film Like Mike. In 2004, he played a firefighter named Tommy Drake in Ladder 49. He's worked with Steven Seagal three times, Under Siege 2 Dark Territory in 1995 as Seagal's reluctant partner and lead male villain in Half Past Dead in 2002 and Prince of Pistols in 2008. Morris Chestnut joined the cast of Nurse Jackie in 2013, playing war veteran Dr. Ike Prentice. The following year, he won the NAACP Image Award for Outstanding Supporting Actor in a Comedy Series. In 2015, he played Derek Dog Prince in the movie Heist. In 2015, People magazine named Morris Chestnut as one of the sexiest men alive. To prepare for his role as professional football player Lance Sullivan in the movie The Best Man Holiday, Morris Chestnut had to get back into shape. His fitness training experience with celebrity fitness trainer Obi Obadiki inspired him to become Obadiki's co-author on the health and fitness book The Cut. The Cut, published on April 18, 2017, contains exercise drills and recipes. Morris Chestnut played the lead role of pathologist Dr. Beaumont Rosewood Jr. in Rosewood, receiving another NAACP Image Award nomination. He appeared as Raymond DuPont in the short-lived drama Our Kind of People. About Morris Chestnut's Real Estate Morris Chestnut has called LA's northwestern suburbs home for many years. In 2007, he paid $3.3 million for a hilltop property in Hidden Hills, California. He sold his home in 2012 for $2.3 million, a painful $1 million loss. In November 2020, he paid $2.44 million for a home in Calabasas, California. 
The 6,610 square foot house has six bedrooms and eight bathrooms. About Morris Chestnut's car collection. Morris Chestnut owns or has owned a Rolls-Royce Phantom, a 1968 Lincoln Continental, and a Cadillac Escalade. Thanks so much for watching this video. Don't forget to give us a like and share us with your friends. Subscribe and you'll never miss out on great content like this in your feed.